To convert from deanery to hexadecimal, it is easier to convert the number into binary first. Write the binary place values from right to left from 1 to 128 for an 8-bit number. Starting from the left, see if the place value fits into the deanery number. If it does, write 1 and subtract the place value, otherwise write 0. 128 does not fit into 76, so 0 has been written below the 128 place value. 64 does fit into 76, so put a 1 below the 64 place value. When a 1 is written, that place value is subtracted from the deanery number. So 76 take away 64 gives the new deanery number of 12. 32 does not fit into 12, so 0 is written below the 32 place value. 16 does not fit into 12 either, so 0 is written below the 16 place value. 8 does fit into 12, so 1 is written below the 8 place value, and 8 is subtracted from 12 to make the new deanery number 4. 4 fits into 4, 1 is written below the 4 place value, 4 is subtracted by 4 to make the new deanery value 0. Both 2 and 1 do not fit into 0, so a 0 is written beneath the 2 place values. 76 has now been converted into binary. To convert the number into hexadecimal, the place values need to be changed from a single byte to two separate nibbles, with 1248, 1248 as the place values. Hexadecimal represents 16 values, 0 to 9 and then A to F. 10 to 15 are replaced by letters. Add together the place values that have a 1 beneath them. For the left nibble, it is just 4. The right nibble is equal to 12, 8 plus 4. 12 in hexadecimal is equivalent to the letter C. The final conversion is now complete. 76 was converted into binary to make 01001100. This was then converted into hexadecimal to give 4C. Converting a deanery number into hexadecimal by converting it first into binary is a valid method in an exam of making the switch between those two number systems. However, there is an alternative method which allows you to convert directly from deanery into hexadecimal, as long as you know the 16 times table and have an understanding of both integer division and modulo division, which are topics from paper two. To work out the left nibble, you would need to use integer division. For example, 76 integer division 16 gives you four as that is a whole number when 76 is divided by 16. To work out the right nibble, you would need to do the deanery number, 76, and then modulo division, 16. 16 goes into 76 four times. 16, 32, 48, and 64. Modulo division works out the remainder from that 64 to the original value of 76, which is a remainder of 12. 12 in hexadecimal is C, 